This Health in Focus is a paid segment by Jag and Nathan Neurosurgery. Well, we are here in person with Dr. Jag and Nathan, board certified neurosurgeon here in West Branch. And we've got Dave, he's from Lovells, one of his patients. Today we're talking about less invasive spinal surgery. So Dr. Jay, tell us what, what kind of uses you can, you can employ this with. So by minimally invasive, we mean that we use uh, the combination of uh, uh, fluoroscopy, meaning uh, navigation using x-ray guidance, uh, along with uh, uh, preoperative x-ray imaging, such as M MRI and x-rays, to find the area where the, there's an abnormality in the spine. And instead of doing a traditional approach, which could be a, a large incision, you know, where you retract a lot of muscles, in minimally invasive approaches, you tend to make a smaller incision, which uh, ideally leads to a quicker recovery. And, and less so pain postoperatively. And but what kind of spinal surgeries can this be used for? Uh, it can be used for basically uh, basically any type of surgery. It ranges from really small surgeries like lumbar disc herniations to more complicated surgeries like lumbar fusions, like Mr. Worcester had. Uh, you can use it for cancer and trauma. Actually, I started adapting into my practice when I worked in Detroit when we had a, a big cancer center and a big trauma hospital and we were getting patients who couldn't tolerate major operations. Okay. And, and so tell us a little bit about what Dave's condition was and how you used this surgery to help him. Uh, so basically it was a combination of, uh, uh, of some discs and, uh, and bone spurs that were causing pressure on the nerves along with some displacement of a couple of the vertebrae which sometimes happens through uh, arthritis and through degeneration. Uh, and those cause pressure on the nerves and oftentimes causes leg pain and back pain as well. Okay. So. All right. All right. So now, Dave, let's tell, let's hear about what, what your life was like before this surgery. What brought you here? Well, obviously it was the pain, the lower back pain. And <clears throat> I could barely walk 100 feet back and out to my barn and back to the house with no strength, no energy, no sleep. I lost 25 pounds. Oh gosh. Um, that's when I come seeing... Dr. Jake and Nathan, uh -huh. and he gave me my options of what I can do and what not to do. And okay. so I chose to go with the surgery and everything's been nothing but professional with this office, his staff, Dr. Jake and Nathan. Yeah. My hat's off to all the staff here. So how are you feeling? It's like a miracle. Yeah, unbelievable. I recommend Dr. Jake and Nathan to anybody that has back Right. How long did it take you to recover after that surgery? I was up two weeks mowing grass and riding my Harley. Wow. <laughs> now I'm, now I'm, I'm hunting and doing everything. 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 Wonderful. Well, that's great Perfect. to hear. Very uh, satisfied. Wonderful. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and of course, if you want more information about these kind of less invasive surgeries about Dr. J, you can always head to our website, 9in10news.com. This Health in Focus is a paid segment by Jag and Nathan Neurosurgery.